Welcome to That's Easy, the video tutorial series that helps to use Wattlow Easy Zone products. In this installment, we will show how to change the temperature related display units between degrees Fahrenheit and Celsius, to change the communication units that affect the temperature related data transferred between Fahrenheit and Celsius, and discuss the temperature related units used by LabVIEW and SpecView software packages. The EasyZone models with a seven segment display may be set to display temperature related information in degrees Fahrenheit or Celsius. The models utilizing these serial or ethernet protocols may be set independently to transfer temperature related information in degrees Fahrenheit or Celsius. And models utilizing the standard bus serial communications communicating to National Instruments LabVIEW or the SPEC UHMI software will always transfer temperature related information in degrees Fahrenheit. These software packages have means within them to perform temperature conversion if required. The following procedure requires entering the setup page. Use caution while in the setup page so that you do not change other parameters. The unintended changes can have significant impact to your process. If the setup page is not accessible using this method, a lockout feature may be in effect. Contact the original equipment manufacturer or systems integrator if access is denied, as they may have implemented a password to prevent accidental changes. To change the seven segment display to show all temperature related values in the unit of choice, enter the setup page global menu by pressing both arrow keys at the same time until SCT is displayed in green for setup. Do not release when OPER is displayed. If you do, you need to exit the operations page with the infinity or reset key and try again. Next, press either the up or down arrow key until GLBL is displayed for the global menu in red. Press the advanced key until the parameter C underscore F is displayed in green. Using either key, press F for Fahrenheit or C for Celsius. Pressing the infinity or reset key for two seconds returns the display to the home page. All temperature related data in the controller is converted. This step only affects values displayed on the seven segment readout. To change the serial or ethernet communications to transfer data, in the units of choice requires you to either write to a memory location within the easy zone or change the display units in the setup page communications menu. The write value sent is either 30 for degrees Fahrenheit or 15 for degrees Celsius. The instance of which memory location to write is based on the communications port of the controller having the non-standard bus protocol. Communications port 1 will be instance 1 and communications port 2 will be instance 2. The method to perform a write will vary based on the available protocol. Please refer to the user's manual for the appropriate memory location or register. To change the communications display units to transfer all temperature related values in the unit of choice, enter the setup page communications menu by pressing both arrow keys at the same time until SET is displayed in green for setup. Do not release when OPER is displayed. If you do, you need to exit the operations page with the infinity or reset key and try again. Press either the up or down arrow key until COM is displayed for the communications menu in red. Note that the letter M uses two digits. Press the advanced key until the parameter C underscore F is displayed in green. Using either arrow key, Select F for Fahrenheit or C for Celsius. Press in the infinity or reset key for two seconds returns the display to the home page. This step only affects temperature related data transferred via the communications port. Let's review what we've covered. We've demonstrated how to change the display units of the seven segment display in the setup page global menu. We discussed that the communications data is independently set 
and to make the change by either entering the setup page, communications menu, or perform a write transaction using the communications protocol. And that standard bus always sends all temperature related data in degrees Fahrenheit via the EIA 485 serial port. Still have questions? Refer to any supplied user's manuals for the equipment and controller. Electronic copies of the Easy Zone controller manuals are available on Watlow's website. Questions on the equipment should be directed to the original equipment manufacturer or systems integrator. Only they know the equipment and the required controller settings. For questions specific to the controller, email Watlow Technical Support at wintechsupport at watlow.com or call and speak to an application engineer at 507-494-5656 between 7 and 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. If you email or call Watlow, be sure to have the controller's model number. We hope you found this installment of That's Easy helpful. We'll explore additional topics in other installments.